Hi there, Dr. Nora here. Happy Ramadan to you all. If you don't already know, Ramadan is a month that is observed by many people across the world, which involves fasting from sunrise to sunset. Now that can be quite a long period of time for many people, and there are some risks involved. For example, dehydration, medication, and whether or not you're actually suitable to fast. It's been agreed by many scholars that those who are pregnant or breastfeeding, or those who are on certain medications, or the frail and elderly should not fast. However, if you're able to fast, I'm here to motivate you on the advantages of fasting. Firstly, fasting allows you a time to have a detox. Now for me personally, I wake up, I have a coffee, at lunchtime I have a coffee, and when I come back from work I have a coffee as well. And before I know it, I've had so much caffeine throughout my day. And for substances like caffeine, the more you have, the more you need. So by fasting, it gives you an opportunity to pause, rewind, and reset your body so that you don't need to use as much caffeine, for example. Furthermore, you get to rediscover your diet. Now, when you're fasting, you may want to opt for some starchy foods in the morning to give you that energy throughout the day. And when you come to break your fast, you'll probably have something sugary, which will give you that energy boost, such as a piece of fruit followed by some vegetables and protein which will replenish your nutrients. So by doing this, it gives you an opportunity to connect food with your body. So you're no longer living to eat, but eating to live. I hope that you do manage to fast and you're able to do so and it's successful and you have a blessed month. I must stress, however, that those of you who are on medication to always seek the advice of your health practitioner. There are some medications that you must not stop and you may be exempt from fasting. I wish you all a very blessed and successful Ramadan. Take care and stay healthy.